Welcome to your director. Now that you are successfully connected, it's time to perform the initial setup. To start, click on the three bars in the top right hand corner. Click on settings and set your time zone. In this menu, you can also change the wireless channel, access system information, as well as a walkthrough guide. Exit the menu by clicking anywhere and click on the time to set the correct date and to set the correct time. The top half of the screen is where your tanks will be displayed, with all relevant information. Here you can see the tank's name, the current number of lights assigned to the tank, the active effects, and the current weather in the tank. Each of your real-world tanks will correspond to a tank in the browser. You can add new tanks by clicking on the plus on the right-hand side. Click on the tank name to assign a name to this tank. Click inside the circle to set a picture of your tank. To assign lights to this tank, click on the Layout tab. This is what we call the Blueprint. Before attempting to discover your lights, be sure the indicator LEDs on the side of all lights are red. If an LED is green, hold the button on your light down for about 8 seconds until the LED begins to rapidly flash between red and green, then release after which it should turn red. Once all of your light's indicator LEDs are red, click Discover. All found modules will appear on the right hand side of the screen. Drag the lights onto the blueprint and place them in the same configuration they are in above your tank. If your lights use a wireless adapter, choose which light type it is after dragging the light to the blueprint. To get more information about a particular light, simply double click it. This will cause the light to flash so you can easily identify it above your tank. In this menu, you can change the group a light is in, get the model type, temperature, fan status, serial number, and wireless signal strength of the light, as well as update the light's firmware. To change a light's group, simply click on the group color that you would like to add the light to. Groups are most useful if you need to set certain lights at a lower intensity in order to acclimate new livestock. Once you are finished, click Save. Your tank's information will update automatically. You can now go to the Control tab to set your light's ramps or to the Effects tab to add effects. See our other videos to learn more about your director.